Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video. Today we are going to be talking about the status of helium mining for the month of June. I did a video on this for May and it got some good feedback, so I figured I'd do it again. To start off, I just want to say that helium mining is the wave right now. Everyone is trying to get into it. There is a massive, massive supply chain issue and they're trying to work as best as they can. <clears throat> In the previous video, I mentioned the miners that are offered and if I go on to helium where I just had the website open there are uh, five but essentially four because this is the same brand um, helium miners that you can purchase that are approved by helium uh, themselves there's a pr uh, there's an approval process that takes place in order to approve the miners it's a three-step process you have to get approved via hip 19 and then it has to be approved via the FCC and then they can start shipping them out. So last time we talked, I said that the Bobcat Miner was your best case scenario. Things have changed. I'm not sure if I can say the Bobcat Miner is the best case scenario. It is obviously, I'm pretty sure it is the most profitable right now just on based on how they're built. They have a lot of, uh, a lot of RAM, I believe. But anyway, I'm gonna start off with the Rack Hotspot Miner. I bought two of these in March and they were estimated to ship out in June. I was order around 20,000, and right now they have actually paused all orders. They had it running for a bit where you could enter in your name and stuff here, and then they would pick, I think, 250 people a day that were eligible to pre-order the device, and now they're not accepting any orders at this time because there has been such a backup in orders. Now, if I go here, this is the shipping calculator, I entered order 20,000. Remember I said it was gonna be due in June, June slash July, I would, I would be optimistic and say July. Um, it's October now, so that's what, three, four months? Uh, I know it's at least 12 weeks backed up that I could be making money, so it's unfortunate, but you know, you can't prepare for this kind of stuff. They didn't really expect this many devices to be ordered. I mean, I'm on 20,000. I'm sure if I go to the shipping update here, it'll tell me. Uh, yeah, Yak. See, I'm Velociraptor, <clears throat> and Yak and Zebra are after me. So I'm sure if I click search again, maybe thirty thousand is Yak, maybe forty thousand is Zebra. Yeah. So I'm literally halfway down from the latest order if you were to place today but they they closed their orders and i'm still not even close to getting it so you can see they have a lot of orders that's forty thousand orders and each order might have more than one and they did state that they are going to be working on their orders based on um whoever has more orders in the um Sorry, I'm trying to see what it says. They, they said as soon as possible. Oh yeah, here it is. Nope, I am, it's up here. Um, okay, maybe I can't find it. But, oh yeah, here it is, okay. The fulfillment team does pick orders ahead of time based on the quantity of hotspots. So if I order 20 hotspots, they are going to fulfill it quicker than if I ordered one but it's still gonna be in the same time frame, so don't order, you can't on this website right now, but if they resume it, don't order 20 hotspots expecting to get them next week, you're still gonna be very far down the line. So that's the rack miner, pretty much no chance you guys can actually get that one now. Now we're gonna to go to the Nebra one. Nebra had the same thing, or Nebra had the same thing that they were going on with the rack hotspot miner, where they're having a limited supply that they were allowing people to pre-order per day now they have closed all orders they sold out they have to catch up on their uh, orders the interesting about interesting thing about both of these companies they have insane supply chains they are they have very well designed orchestrated building all these things they have the infrastructure to handle it but it's the shortages that are causing all of these backlogs neighbor miner also reached with an update they sent out uh, i think it was yesterday today's the fourth i'm recording this if you ordered from batch four, uh, you will receive it in July, which are the 26th to the April 12th. 
and batch five, April 12th to be determined. This is quarter three. This is gonna be another one where you're not gonna expect it until October, September area. It sucks. If you want them, you can't get them, but it shows how um, how high the, the demand is for these things. And this is 300 pounds, which is, I think it was roughly 400 and something dollars. Um, so that's uh, that's a never one. Uh, can you look up here? Oh, they do have a calculator. That's very cool. I know I placed it in order four, but that's awesome that they have a calculator here so you can check to see when your estimated number. I think I'm like 10,000. Let's see if that'll... Uh, batch three. Okay, I'm not 10,000. But it'll tell you... I, I guess it just tells you what batch it is in, and then you don't know. So right now, basically what happened... Um, batch one, they just shipped it May 17th, which is what, two weeks ago, a little over two weeks. Uh, this was supposed to ship in March. So you can see how far backlog never is as well. I think they're catching up, but I'm unsure because, uh, on their update, they did state that they're, they're trying to catch up and they should be shipping batch one, two, and three. I believe it says it here. Uh, they should be shipping one, two, and three, um, Toward, or one and two towards the end of June and batch three they're still waiting on some components but they hope to be shipping in June or start shipping in June um, and but it will likely spill over to July so Nebra is another one it's not looking too hot so if we go to uh, Bobcat Miner Bobcat Miner I ordered one of these I ordered it uh, after April 4th I think I ordered it April 12th something around that area uh, I think I'm like 20,000 for the order number again, unless I, I'm getting it all wrong. But I know I am not in batch five, so I guess I'm in batch six. Uh, Bobcat Miner, you can still order them. This seems to be the only one that you can actually order right now. However, uh, the shipping, it says it's going to be shipping towards, I believe, 12 to 20 weeks. So April, after April 12th, I believe it is for Bobcat. It went from 8 to 12 weeks to 12 to 20 weeks from the order date. So you're not going to be getting this thing until, like I said, with all the other ones, September, October. It's a very far out. Um, it's far out. And you, you can be making a lot of – there's a lot of potential income that you're missing out on because you're not getting these. And that's all because of COVID. It's all because of supply chains. It's because the factory in China burned down a year ago, and I, I guess it's still messing up everything. Um, but that's, that's Bobcat – Honestly, I don't think you guys have a, a really good chance at getting one of these miners. This is the synchro bit one. This is the one that might show potential. They increase their price a lot because there is a high demand. And the unfortunate thing with this one is it's not even FCC approved yet. So you're ordering this with, um, it's, I would say a 50, 50 chance. There's a fair chance it's going to be approved by the FCC, but only time will tell, and who knows how long that will actually take. Thankfully, all orders are fully refundable for any reason until the package is shipped. That's great. So if they don't get approved by the FCC, you can uh, you can get your money back. But all orders paid April 9th are projected to ship in June. April 10th to the 20th are shipped in mid-July, and after 20th are shipped in mid-September. It's probably going to be pushed over to October. The big question with this company is not a lot of people have actually seen these hands on. I have no clue if they have a massive warehouse that they have hundreds of thousands, well, probably just thousands of these miners already built just waiting to be shipped or if they are waiting to be FCC approved to ship. I'm not sure how that whole manufacturer process goes with them, but that is that. That's synchro bit. Now, if I go to the helium store, that was all five of them, I believe. Let's see if they mention any other ones. Sometimes if you go in here, it will tell you if there's other options for helium, um, new ones that are waiting to be approved and stuff. I did mention a different one a few videos back that just got announced and you can sign up to be a pre-order, but there's no down payment. It's kind of just an email and it gives you an opportunity to buy if they actually get approved by HIP19 and uh, FCC and all that stuff. So <clears throat> let me take a breath for a second. All right. The price of helium right now is $14.90. It's been fluctuating. It's been 
fairly steady, I would say, between about $12 and $20. So you could say it's been about $16 pretty steadily. If you want to buy helium and you don't want to buy these miners because, you know, you're not going to get to till September, uh, I would recommend buying on weekends. That's what I would do. And I have to say it's not financial advice. So this is what I would do. I would buy it on Saturday or Sunday. It's usually when the price goes down and I will buy however many I can get my hands on and then I can wait. And then midweek sometimes, let's let's say, uh, look at this. Uh, Sunday was actually at an all-time high and it looks like Friday it was at a high too. Um, Tuesday. So it changes every week, but what I would do is I would watch the market. If it gets pretty high, I would sell it and then buy back in, stuff like that. Just so you guys can get some or just so I would get some um, some more money on the side in case that helium actually takes off, which it's projected to do. But who knows? It could go up. It could go down. It's a 50-50. But there are a lot of um, points pointing it at uh, going up just based on Google is investing in it. And, I mean, you guys saw the amount of miners that are going on it. If I go to crypto and I go to helium here, Go to Helium Place. I believe this is it. No, this is the wrong one. If I go to Coverage Map, this is where you can see. Wow, there's a lot more miners than last time. Um, when I went on this a month or two ago, there was only 20,000 miners on here. So now there's 50,000. You can say this, pl this place is lit up like a Christmas tree. The United States. Um, you can see Hong Kong, China. Asia area is lit up and then Europe. I mean, look at the United Kingdom. That is a stacked place. London, these people, I mean, if I click this one, uh, let's go to this one, view hotspot details. Over the past, it should tell you rewards here. Over the past 30 days, it's made 56 helium. If I go here and I go, all right, 56 times 15. It's made $840 over the past 30 days. That's just incredible. Um, but <laughs> you can't get them. That's, they're literally money printing machines and you can't get them. It sucks. Um, if I want to go here, this is if you guys are down bad to get helium miners, as the kids say, right? You want one. You want to get one? You can't get them anywhere. They're sold out. Rack sold out. Helium sold out. Bobcat, eh, you're not going to get till October. So it's pretty much, I mean, sold out. Who knows? You might not even get it until the f next year. You might not get it till February or March of next year. And by that point, it might not even be worth it. But it probably still will be. It's just, what if you don't want to wait? Well, if you don't want to wait, there's something called eBay, where scalpers make bank. So if you want to go and buy one on eBay, I'm going to go end it recently because this is, oh my gosh, $5,000. Um, this is where you probably have a good chance. You'll be paying more than the pre-order cost, but you'll have a better chance of actually getting it because you're buying it, you know, you're buying an earlier order rather than ordering it today. So I've never heard of Dragino Helium Hotspot. I don't, Dragino? What is this? Oh, it's something, it's something different. Okay. So, sorry, I just had to look that up. I've never seen that before. If you guys want to buy one, um, go on eBay. They have auctions and they have buy it now. If you want one immediately, you're going to be paying upwards of $5,000 to $10,000. Yes, I did not stutter. I might have stuttered, but I didn't. Um, like that's, that's how much you're going to be paying. This one's $4,300 for it on hand. How much did it cost? It costs like uh, 350 bucks, I believe. Uh, so they're going. These people are making a lot of money just selling them. They might even be making more money than they would mining helium. It's unlikely. But this is your best opportunity at actually getting one. Unfortunately, if I go and search highest, or here we go, highest first. 10 brand new hotspots. 60 thousand dollars someone paid sixty thousand dollars for 10 hotspots this is not play money that is a lot of money i can buy very nice things for my car for my house stuff like that it's incredible how much these are valued right now i don't know if you guys haven't ordered 
I don't know if you guys have a chance of ordering them, to be quite frank with you, other than eBay or Bobcat seems to be the only one that is guaranteed you're going to get it. Nebra, Rack, um, and then there's Synchrobit, but Nebra and Rack sold out. Synchrobit, still waiting for approval. Guys, I think I'm still going to have to go with the Bobcat Miner if you guys want to get one or go on eBay. That, those are my two options. Um, uh, hopefully, I'll have a video covering some new miners that are coming up on the market. Uh, you know, how to buy certain miners, stuff like that. Whatever you guys want to see, please let me know in the comments below. I hope this video was helpful. I might have rambled a little bit, so let me know if you guys have any questions, if you want to leave any feedback. Everything is appreciated, and I will get back to you guys if you do ask questions as soon as I am capable. If I don't know the answer, I will look it up and I will try and help everyone out. So this is a community. We're all working together to make some helium, make some dough and build this network. If you guys have any questions, I'm repeating myself. I will talk to you all in the next one. I hope everyone has a great day. Peace out.